Do you want to show your business location on your site? There is an easy and quick solution. Is Google Map. But is the map giving you time harder and harder while you are trying to show business location? Then you can simply go for advanced Google Map widget. In this video tutorial, I'm gonna show you how to use the advanced Google Map widget for displaying business location on your site. So allow me to start the tutorial. Come to the Elementor dashboard. Here I have inserted advanced Google Map widget earlier. You should keep in mind that Google Map works with the API key. Without generating or set up Google Map API key, you will not be able to use the advanced Google Map widget successfully. So now the question is how you can make or set up Google Map API key. About this, you will find a video in this video description. So check it out. To use the advanced Google Map widget is really super easy. Just come to Google Map section. Here you can control the zoom of the map. Just you have to scroll default zoom scroll bar or if you don't want to give the zoom effect just you can uncheck from here see this is the natural look of google map also you can control street view and map type just you have to use these two on off options i mean street view control and map type control See there is map height scroll bar. Using this scroll bar you can adjust or manage the Google map height. See what I am doing. There is another switcher button named search address. If you want to add the search options with the map you can easily enable that. Just you have to enable search address switcher bar. When enabling the search address bar, you will find the alignment, control and spacing options. I'm selecting alignment center, right, and from here I am giving a spacing between search bar and map. Look at the another section marker. I'm clicking on the marker section and see there is a refitter and you can add more refitter just you have to click on the add item guys now I will show you how you can find latitude and longitude value just you have to go to maps.google.com Just you have to click on what location you want to set in latitude and longitude field. Just you have to click on the map and see here is a latitude and longitude value. Just you have to copy and come back to editor and paste. After pasting the value, see right side there is another mode marker. From here you can set the marker icon or marker image. I'm selecting this marker and inserting from media. I'm zooming out the map and see this location I've copied the latitude and longitude value of this location and this is the marker that I have added from marker mode this time I'm going to show you another way to collect the latitude and longitude value and see I'm finding the latitude and longitude value of Burj Khalifa so I'm giving the Burj name Burj Khalifa and searching. Mm -hmm. 
see Burj Khalifa and I'm clicking here after clicking on Burj Khalifa and, and come to the address bar and see after the and percent this this one is the latitude value and and this one for longitude value now I'm going back to editor again and see there is a title here you can set title and I'm giving BD themes part and in the content field you can set the business location and see I'm giving business location Burgra Bangladesh after setting title and content take mouse and see the title BD theme park come to style tab and see Google map style there is a field of pasting JSON code now how you can find the JSON code just click this URL as I'm doing I'm scrolling down and choosing this one and look at the left side and expand code and you have to copy all this code I'm clicking ctrl C copying and going back to editor and and giving ctrl V this is the way to style the advanced Google map so guys hope you understand how it works at this time I'm giving ctrl A and deleting the code guys there is another way to style the advanced Google map widget and it is none other than CSS filter see there is blur brightness contrast and saturation and hue option scroll bar using these options you can style the Google map widget and see the changes Now similarly you can go for hover to CSS filter see there is another section search if you want to style the search bar you can do that from here so hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial one more thing if you feel this video is not enough you can go for dog on how to use advanced Google map widget and how to set up Google map API key and and the dog link you will find in the description of this video thanks for watching